atmosphere of folks in the devil. They're doing. I'm here, folks in Dallas. Yes, sir. They need to do cameras down there, and I, and the, the, I think they can fix it pretty easy. But uh, they, uh, I just got it strapped up with a tie strap right now. I understand. Are they coming in this direction? I can't hear them. Yes, sir. They said they were headed to folks. All right, understand. Thank you, Straight Matt Trout. Good morning from the CSX A-Line. Currently, I'm in Folkestone, Georgia, waiting for CSX Q453, a southbound manifest with dragging equipment. Stopped right in front of us. This was that the coolest the catch of the, the entire day. The end of the car. All right, on here now. Be right back with you. Multiple CSX employees showed up at the scene to assess the damage. then brought the train to a stop again to ensure the train had three-step protection to make sure everything was working correctly.
Very soon, the train was back and rolling again once the issue was fixed. The CSX employees were very fast in fixing the train. The whole issue only took about 20 minutes to fix. The second train of the day was CSX N040, a southbound coal train. The third train of the morning was a northbound hotshot CSX manifest. I'm not sure of the ID on this train though. later came a hotshot southbound CSX intermodal train, the third train of the day. Not much longer later came Amtrak number 91, five hours late. The slow period of the day in the folks is in the afternoon. 
and now afternoon was approaching and the slow period was well underway. But Q441 broke the silence. Q441 is a southbound manifest coming out of Waycross with a very nice lash up. Later in the day came Amtrak P098, the northbound silver meteor bound for New York City. A few weeks later, I went back to Folkestone for another trip, but I didn't do that much recording. I only recorded two things. The first thing that I recorded was an Amtrak equipment move coming from Florida and going to Washington, D.C. I've never seen an Amtrak equipment move before full of empty coaches. Very interesting. The second thing that I recorded was a train with BNSF foreign power. I only took photos because as you can imagine, after all of this video, my SD card was getting very full. So I only took photos, so I will let a slideshow play of the photos that I took of the BNSF foreign power. I hope you enjoyed this video of rail fanning in Folkestone, Georgia. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe for new videos every week. Thanks for watching.